here on the farm of Colum and Louise Quinn, uh, who live just outside Eden Derry. They have a pedigree Charlie herd, and uh, this is a set of twins that were just born recently. You can just see the housing environment here. Louise has an incredible interest in the breeding of stock and the care of them. And this is the proper way to look after freshly cow cows. This cow had a set of twins born. They have uh, a bull and a heifer. And unfortunately, uh, 90, the bull is here on the left, and on the right is the heifer, which is a bit smaller. The cow is a bit nervous here looking. She's protective of the calves, and that's why she's manner uh, would be uh, cautious in case guarding her uh, twin calves. Uh, this set of calves will result in about 98% of the time the female being infertile. What occurs during pregnancy is that the male afterbirth fuses with the female afterbirth and that's called anastomosis. During this uh, event and uh, resulting thereafter, the male starts producing testosterone from about 65 to 70 days of pregnancy, which traverses to the female and results in sterilization of the female or failure of the female genitalia to develop. This results in the free marking condition it does not um, occur in humans or in, in other uh, livestock and unfortunately uh, results in the female having to be called. Males and male bulls are from uh, twins have uh, lower fertility. Uh, the reasons in behind that, again from the female side and the hormonal environment in the womb. Uh, frequently, it is a question asked, uh, would the male breed? Yes, the males breed, but successfully, but are less fertile.